Hey, it's Jeff and Matt, and today we're just talking about accounts receivables. Uh, most businesses have accounts receivables. They have invoices that they did work on and they need to get paid. What's some advice you give to companies on how to optimize their accounts receivables? Well, first, first of all, it starts their own internal efforts. Uh, they need to optimize what they do internally. Now that sounds simple, <laughs> but oftentimes they're short staffed, Right? They don't have the resources to really do that, but we always recommend to be consistent, bill right away, bill consistently, um, definitely have some sort of follow-up uh, process, whether that's emails, phone calls, text messages, whatever it may be, and then timing is everything. So the more consistent they can be with that, the better, better they are. So, so have a process, like, like you said, consistency is key. So have a process on when you're going to be billed, how you're going to follow up, how many phone calls you're going to make. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. And then time is, time is an issue for them. So, you know, they need to make that somewhat of a priority because receivables is a, a big part of a business. It's the, it's the cash flow. And many times if they're out doing their jobs, they don't have time to worry about the bills and getting those out. But being consistent is key. At some point, the bills get old. They start to get ignored or issues come up with consumers or businesses and they, they're not getting paid. Then what? Well, so that's where they need to trust their aging sheet. So we know that after a certain point, no matter how good they are, how good their process is, no matter how many people they have on it, there's a point where these people just start to ignore right. the statements, the emails, the phone calls and whatnot. So that's when they really need to look towards help. Um, you know, obviously a third party is very helpful in that situation. We recommend start with something that's low cost. Uh, they need to look for someone who's very diplomatic. So, uh, you know, the two biggest concerns we hear over and over again is, I don't want to pay a whole bunch to a third party and I don't want them to alienate my customers. So they'd rather keep working them internally, holding on to them. And that gets older and it, older. It gets and older and harder and, and tougher to collect. So if they can find an agency that's more diplomatic, one that, that offers a low cost solution, it's much more feasible for them to use sooner in the process, which is where the money's more collectible. And in turn, that, that results in saving internal costs and helps them with their cash flow. And it is also part of the process, right? It's uh, part of the process. Where, where a collection agency becomes part of the accounts receivable process. Right, yeah. yep. So if you're a business, you have receivables and even delinquent accounts that are getting old, don't take it personal, it's gonna happen in business, but there's help out there for you. Absolutely.